fucking day. Hashtag DFAMD. Please hit us up. We are here. Back in silence. If you've got some energy, please make some noise. Yeah, shout out to all my people on the stage, all my people in the crowd. It's your boy, uh, you know, hit me up. All the links are on the screen right now. It's sixth birthday shit, day number two. We are drawing to a close. It's the last three battles of the day. It's been so fucking good. The weekend has been off the hook, trust me. All right, MC on my right hand side. I'm introduced for this last minute four day prep. One round, you heard me right. One round, four day prep battle. You know the name. To my right hand side, please make you feel welcome. Make some noise for you, Nanam Lord! Do not fear that Tony D title match will be going down December 2014 or January 2015. Trust me, we'll let it all go like that real soon. Alright, and MC on my left hand side, smashed the adult block this year, returning for one last battle before the year's out. You know the name, make some noise for so Big up both these guys, man. Like I said, very, very last minute. We couldn't give the fans, you know what I mean? The title match, of course, we had to put someone else in the card to make sure they got their money's worth. It's going to be a dope battle, man. Because it was real, real last minute, it's one round. But anyway, all right. Soul was cool. We're going first, so it is one of two rounds on Soul. Let's go. Yo, good evening. Yo, now you and Flex Explicit are always arguing on Facebook, but straight up, it seems like you should be best of friends to me. Because <laughs> you both represent the league by being five foot two annoying and on Twitter 24 7 trying to beg it with American MCs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yo, we'll just add him to the long list of people that have haunted you online who a fortnight later you say sorry to him why. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think the monstrosity would find he needs his policies revised because he's made apologies more times than all the league combined. <laughs> Yo, I can't even read out that fucking list to the crowd. If I tried, they call time. It's an unlimited round. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo. And what are you bitching about? They're the ones who didn't want to see We Clash. Shit, half this crowd doesn't even know this is a rematch. <laughs> right? Right. Yo. Well, if you don't know, I beat him before on Get Slated. That one was PG, this one is X rated. Mm. Better have the drive to survive, forget Wayland. Have to kill the mark in the sequel, Death Racing. And if you ask for a trilogy, it'll worsen for him. See, the first was a win, this is curtains for him. If the third is a thing, then you burn in the ring. So, in more ways than one, this is Return of the King. <laughs> Why'd you ask that? Why did Tommy ask them to set a battle up with the one guy who always backs the dude and even asked Mr. 13 and Flex Digits not to buy you? So drop the attitude, you little munchkin, or I won't do it next time and the dude will punch you. <laughs> Yo, I clean up after you, solve your problems, prove him something, and your janitor's better than you could ever be. Good will hunt him. Yo, but. Unanimous. <laughs> He's too talentless. <laughs> I'm spitting like this for a joke. You rap like this. <laughs> Yo, how do you do a one minute round and lose half of it? Two adjectives. <laughs> Yo, who's beat him? <laughs> Yo, who's beat him isn't the question. Who has it is? Used to be cool with Flex, but grew arrogant, so they threw hands at him like they beef with the crew. Matt is in. Show up, clash, sling arms like the new cannabis for starting on that young black male like two lips. Unanimous. I don't even have to rinse you getting punked out by Shotty, because before that Don't Flop Plymouth event, you said something that's dodgy. You said me and her are throwing a Plymouth event. <laughs> Yo, look, yeah. He's popping. Yo, no front, no, 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 no front and it shocked me, right? Like, no, all right, picture me, yeah, I'm her in the company lobby with a cup full of coffee and Bam's pitching me ideas like shuffle inbox me. He's down for a two on two, don't even want any money. Cheap venue, dude from the White Rabbit pub says he's got me and I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. We need to run this by Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> Like, yo, Yunnan, yeah, yeah, safe, 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 yo, what do you think of this? Yeah, no, no, two seconds. I just remembered, I don't give a shit. <laughs> yo, you're an idiot. He even talks about the guns that he grips. You come from the sticks and take bi-monthly holidays with your cousins to fish. Well, I got a gun that's so big that it doesn't exist. <laughs> Wrap your head around that one, you son of a bitch. <laughs> No, you got sung by your bitch, and your gal's cold. 
I don't want to give you some advice on the down low, but she got skull fucked, couldn't keep her mouth closed. She getting beat with the head like Al Snow. Oh! Yeah. Yo, but I know that's something you're over, mate, because in the olden days you had a bloated waist. But you can run, swim, jump, skip, row and train on road for days, throw your weights above your shoulder blades until you're old and grey. You're still like a fat and stumpy, sad and grumpy, overweight, Paloma Faith with her dome was shaved, you ogre face, overweight. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I know that's something you're over, mate. Because in the olden days you had a bloated waist. But you can run, swim, jump, skip, row and train on rope for days, throw your weights above your shoulder blades until you're old and grey. You'll still look like a fat and scum, fat and slumpy, sad and grumpy, overweight, Paloma Faith. If her dome was shaved, you ogre face, overbait, with the chromosomes in space, know your place. Tony's grave. This is what you get reprived with. This is what you get reprived with. Oven saying on Shogun's face, your head need ISIS. With a golden age, Shogun's blade, a Wesley snipe with. Killer replace T with a body like Ed Gein stylist. <laughs> Yo, what are you even gonna say? That I don't make free songs? Wow, be all loud. Like, faggots like me are like, he's not proud. Like, I can't rap on beat all rounds, son. You can beatbox now. It's 4 4, no heat all rounds. It's the speed off sound. My head gone, so least got down. I make Leaf Dog bounce. It's battle over, cause he's knocked out. That's the second canvas you can sleep on now. I'm talking rivers of blood like Enoch Powell. That's gassed up. Or you, Nan, when the beat got out, his teeth all ground. The seesaw mouth, all with the rhino, like rock steady and bebop now. That's corrupt. Yeah. Why'd you leave dog pound? I went to the circles of hell and dragged back these hot rounds. You getting three old bars for nothing like Leon Brown. Even, yeah. my, even my sales make a book like a prologue. You're a plain Jane, dime a dozen Joe blogs. I'm Jax Taylor in black leather on the road hog. Mm. Flipping the bird on your roof like ghost dog. Mm. So long. I'm gonna leave you with this moment of clarity. And hopefully you realize what's important in battling. It's whether you present what you've written as a joke or as factually. See, when I talk about photon and tractor beams, death notes, Trojans and cavalry, or Shogun assassins on the road to Damascus, we know it's imaginary that I've just woven a tapestry. But right now, what I'm on serious like Opie and Anthony. Because when you talk about the chrome and the gats you squeeze, the coke and the crack you've seen, and try make me look soft in real life because I don't to embarrass me. It's like you fall into the black hole of the battle scene, try exposing your adversary just to prove that you're more of a man than me, just to back up this persona, this act we need, the exaggeration of our own personality. <laughs> Put on a show for the fans, we please, but you can't separate Tommy from Unanimous. That's so very sad to see. And you buy right into it. At home when you're spamming tweets, hoping that rappers beef, treating this shit like it's a soap that's on Channel 3. <laughs> you just know that's the gas you feed, and the reason that you always lose hold on your sanity. Wow. So if you want to know the difference between Soul and his Whack MC, both of them's fantasy. But when I wrote, mind don't pose as reality. <laughs> yeah. I've got to admit, this class was good fun, and it's impressive as fuck. I managed to lose a, lose a one round battle, two one round. <laughs> <laughs> they said he wasn't gonna show up. He let all of you down. Guess that shotty battle got to the prick's head But really your god knows I'm a thorn in his crown nice. Now cause I'm battling my friend You think I'ma do it with honour? Oh. Bro I'll stick you with a fork as you bow Poltergeist in a church I'm throwing organs around mm. Stood there? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's supposed to be Tony D. I had a throne to seize instead. You got thrown to me, so I'ma grab your throat and scream. What's a king to a god and then punch you out your rosaries? Fuck mm. so. Mm. Fucking bum hole. <laughs> <laughs> when I spit it, you know it's. I got a witty plan. He said he Wesley Snipes, then I'm a demolition man. Mm. You don't really want a fucking bank of war. I'll fucking <laughs> smash you up when I'm rapping stuff. Ah, ah shit. 
This is what happens with four days prep, but fuck it, I'm unanimous. I'm fucking blessed since birth like Jesus of Nazareth. It's the drug taking sadomasochist. Catch me spaced out on an acid trip. So high that I can't see where the planet is. I'm on some fucking nasty shit. Cold smack your bitch. Snatch collateral faster than the rat pack of scavengers and massacre these rappers because I have to embarrass them. Let's talk about soul though. Let's talk about soul. I mean, your girlfriend lives in Canada, right? Yep. I want you to swear on your grandmother's life you've never wanked off on Skype. <laughs> and you talk. <laughs> hey. Hey. Yes. And you said about him setting up an event in Plymouth like that was alright. Bruv, why don't you ask him if he wants to host a battle in Fife? <laughs> Cause I'm fucking the fourth story at Scotland Yard. That's bars on top of bars on top of bars. Mm. Your bare moistness. All oh, them film references are so gay. They're pointless. I don't give a fuck. I see dead people. In fact, I hear their voices. Cause my one-liners connect with soul like clairvoyance. Mm. How we doing this? Huh? I'm cold hearted, my soul's arctic, my actions below freezing. My fists like ice picks, I cold slap you for no reason. Bro, I'm scheming like I got Chiller Jones to write my raps, fam. I thought Jeffrey Punch, he froze tonight and lay soul on ice like brass cast. Mm. Fuck off! <laughs> Scottish prick. Oh, it's fucking four days prick. Scottish prick! Don't say it again. You like a lot of. That's it. Fucking hell. <laughs> Yo. Fucking hell. Jed Mitchell. Got the swagger of a wet tissue. I thought we were friends, mate. So why'd you say all that stuff about my fucking ex missus? Huh? And Facebook statuses, like that would make my world end. Because my Facebook statuses are where you met your girlfriend. <laughs> Yeah, it is. <laughs> you know what? Fuck it, man. Mm. Let's Fuck. go. Make some noise. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. He said, fuck that, I wanna decapitate him and put his head in a toilet. He caught big T and then draw this piece. I saw that blade go from shoulder to shoulder, but you weren't getting anointed. Real talk.